Welcome back everyone to Wings of B. So we've got these horrible spikes to contend with yet again today, so um, I thought that jumping might help, and I think it would if I could just get the timing right. And I can shoot in the right direction. Hmm. Still pretty tough. Oh, okay. I shot it one more time than I needed to. Alright, well that wasn't ac that bad, actually. Oh boy. How can I get through that? Um... Oh, right. Wow. Wow, there's not enough time to react to that. Okay, well, I just have to shoot further back. There we go. And it changed my weapon again. Hmm. I probably did that without realizing it. Okay. on. No. Okay. is harder than it looks. No! Uh. What? I hit respawn and it put me here. Is it because... I guess it's because I hit respawn around the time that the Orb of Life saved me and it cancelled out the respawn. Please be a safe point. Yes. Okay. 
Okay. You know, the... The more games I play, the more I dislike dogs. Shovel Knight had a very similar enemy. Although I don't know if it was a dog. Okay. I'm not doing that right, I think. I don't know why I'm getting these long loading screens now. Or black screens, whatever you want to call them. I guess it's not really a loading screen if it doesn't say anything. Although, it could be. I've actually messed around a bit with uh, game design myself. I've never published anything. I've never made anything halfway decent either. I'm not a very creative person, I'm, uh, I mainly just like to write code, so <laughs> that was the main thing I was going for when making games. And I would always get bored once I got it to work and never finished anything. I think I actually still have, uh, uh, I took one game dev course in college, and I think I still have what I made in that class, but it, it's not very good. I just made something to match the assignment for the final project, and that was it. I didn't try to do anything really special. I actually really hated that class. I didn't like the professor. And I went to a pretty small university, so never really had like a lot of options uh, for most classes. I think like the first computer science course I took, they had two sections of it. And for some reason, the AI course I took my last semester had uh, two sections as well. I guess they had a lot of seniors that were uh, like built up who weren't able to graduate the year before or something like I was. I, it actually took me five years to graduate because they I couldn't fit enough computer science courses in my schedule. They just didn't offer enough. How many times can I die on this section? A lot, apparently. Oh, Wings V, I don't like you right now. If I was still like a little kid, I probably wouldn't care. I'd probably just fling myself into the spikes like a thousand times until I got it right. But I have surprisingly become less patient as I've gotten older. Well, in some ways. Ah, finally got to the collapsible platform again, then I mess up because I forgot what I needed to do. How typical. 1200 deaths. 
1201. Twelve hundred two. Okay, I'll stop. No. Uh. Okay. No. I knew that would happen. Ah. That part there wouldn't irritate me that much if I'd figured out a reliable way to get through this first area. No, it's still not good enough. If I do a regular jump, I go too high. If I do a flutter, I'm too low. Wow. Of course. Come on, game. Work with me, please. <sighs> I just want to get through this section. Okay, well, I finally got back to the angel mode platform again, which uh, makes me wonder, how do you do this if you're not in angel mode? Huh. Well, I guess you'd have to fly up above from the collapsible platform to that solid platform. And then you'd have to somehow drop back over here. Wait, how, how? There's no way you would have enough jumps for that. What? Seriously, how would you do that? Can't even make it up that high. Oh, I made it. Okay. Well, I still don't know how you would do that part if you weren't in angel mode. Um, I apologize to anyone who's playing in mortal mode. Oh. Back here? Really? What? Okay, what's over here? Nothing. Okay, is there something down below? Yeah. Oh boy. Okay, this... I bet it's going to be a rough boss battle. Oh. Wow. swapping places. Oh, wow. This is gonna be a really tough boss, isn't it?
Oh, I wish I could slide under them, but that would be too easy, wouldn't it? Stop throwing puppies at me. It's r very rude. Okay, probably not going to beat this boss this episode, but uh, I will make another episode for Saturday where I will beat the boss no matter what, no matter how long it takes me. I mean, it'll it'll get edited down to like 20 to 30 minutes either way. Currently, I've only been recording for 25 minutes, and uh, I kind of hate that this bo boss pointed at or came up at this point because uh, currently in Wings of E, I'm cutting about uh, I'd say 50 to 60 percent of what I record. So this would be a pretty short episode. So what's with the shield things they have now? for a little bit. Okay, falling into the pit's a bad thing. Very careful not to let them get me cornered somewhere, I think. Wow, I did a lot of damage to her. Seems like melee attacks are the way to go. got their armor on now. Uh, 
how do you hurt them when their armor is on? Let's actually try switching to this weapon. It has a longer range. So that might work out a little bit better. Or at least I think it does. I could be wrong. Even though they swing their weapons fairly slowly, it's still tough to dodge if you're in the wrong spot at the wrong time. Maybe I should be focusing on one of them. Although I can't do as much damage per second from range. Oh, seriously? Wow. How do you dodge that? Alright, well that's probably enough for this episode. It'll probably be a bit on the short side. Uh, kind of hard to say. So next episode will be out on Saturday unless, you know, the world explodes or something like that. That, that tends to, you know, set back video production a little bit. <laughs> Uh, so thanks for watching. Don't forget you can subscribe if you want to keep up with my videos, and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.